Demand for condos in Hua Hin has become a growing trend in Thailand's real estate market. So in this video, I'm gonna give you a 3D virtual tour of the best Hua Hin condos that are available for sale and for rent, ranging from one bedroom to four bedrooms, with a sales price ranging from 3.1 million to 36 million baht, and a rent price ranging from 16,000 baht to 120 thousand bots. And for you to make best use of this video, I encourage you to follow along by clicking the links in the description of this video, which will take you to a page on the FazWaz website, which are a amazing real estate agency that I've partnered with. And these pages that uh, I've included in the links are actually uh, pre-loaded listings that I've created just for you, where I've divided condos into three price points, condos under four million, four to six million, bot and over 10 million so for example if I click on the link that says condos under 4 million bot it'll take you to this page where I've introduced the filters of uh, a budget of up to 4 million bots and then I've uh, only selected this to only show homes with 3d virtual tours available so that you can tour them like I'm gonna do in this video and also importantly I've uh, screened for properties that are under the foreign quota and that means that non ties will be able to own these properties forever indefinitely without any restrictions as opposed to the Thai quota so that's very important so so now you're on to this page and it says that it has nine properties available on the FASWAS website under these criteria and so what you can do is actually go here to this button that says compare and then uh, it's gonna ask you to sign in or uh, register. So I just quickly sign in with Facebook. And what it's gonna do is it's gonna add uh, this listing to the compare page. Uh, that you can view all these properties in one single page against each other. So you just go ahead and hit compare, 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 and compare. And then you go to your compare list and then it'll conveniently display all these properties that you've added to this one screen, breaking down the listed price, price per square meter, all these features in one page for you to see. So that's really gonna help your uh, browsing experience. If you are a person who wants to search for properties and browse listings on your own. However, if you're thinking, gee, you know, I don't have time for this. I'd rather just have an agent who knows the market, do all the searches for me while I'll just sit back and wait for recommendations. Well, in the link of the description of this video is also a form that you can fill out and put in uh, what you're looking for. And then an agent from FazWaz Property will get back to you and guide you and help you find the right place. So uh, definitely check that out as well. Okay, so the first place that I'm gonna show you is a one bedroom, one bathroom of 54 square meters in size located on the sixth floor of the Breeze Hin project, which was completed in May of 2010. This place is listed for a sales price of 3.15 million baht, bringing the price per square meter to 58,000 baht per square meter. And it's also available for long-term rentals starting 20K per month. So you can either buy this place or opt to rent this place uh, to see if you like it or not. So the breeze Hua Hin is located very close to the beach here. So we know what kind of breeze it's gonna give you. It'll, it should live up to its name. And so um, I'm gonna jump into a 3D walkthrough of this place. Okay, so uh, let's hit zoom up to see the overall layout of this place. So you have uh, uh, one uh, large section here for your uh, kitchen, uh, this, this kitchen here, and then dining area, living room, and then you've got one bedroom, one bathroom. And then uh, there's a balcony there that I'll show you in a second. So I'm gonna hit entrance and jump in from the entrance. And to the left is this corner here dedicated for your kitchen, plenty of space cabinetry down here and overhead comes with a fridge yep and then to the right is an area that you can put your dining table and then uh, further in here is uh, the bathroom of this place which is a pretty standard bathroom 
with a shower. Okay, yeah, this place very bare bones, minimally furnished. And then this area here is for your living room. Uh, comes with a mounted TV. And then it uh, comes with a balcony where the people who shot this um, did not shoot. So I'm gonna have to see the view from the bedroom. So let's step into the bedroom. Okay, pretty nice bedroom, a large bed. To the left is a nice uh, bespoke fitted wardrobe, it says. And it does look like bespoke. I really like this um, dark wood furnishing. And then let's have a look at what kind of view you get. So the view that you get here that I can see peeking out from the curtains is a view from the pool. I know what you're thinking. Do not jump into that pool from here. I know some of you might have that temptation late at night after a few drinks. It's not deep enough. I'm gonna tell you right now, just don't do it. But um, one good thing about this view is that, um, you know, it's a guaranteed view. You know what you're gonna get as opposed to, let's say, getting a place with a view uh, looking outward into another plot of land and uh, if, if there's maybe a, low, uh, a home there or an empty plot of land you don't know if a couple of years down the line they might build something that comes up and completely blocks your view so uh, this is one benefit of having a view of within the condo project so zooming up uh, to conclude the Breeze Hua Hin one of the condos on this list next we move on to a one bedroom one bathroom 44 square meters in size located on the second floor of Autumn Condominium Project which was completed in 2000 2013. This place is for sale for 4.2 million baht, bringing the price per square meter to 95,000 baht per square meter. A bit more expensive than the first place, but that is because this place is by the developer San Siri, one of the top real estate developers in Thailand, and uh, in Thailand brand matters a lot, and they're able to command higher prices, and condos by Sansuri often retain value and appreciate in price. You can also rent this place long term for 25K per month. Uh, Autumn Condominium is located also uh, in, the, in the same area, very close to the beach as well, so, Let's jump into a 3D walkthrough of this place. Okay, ah, okay. Uh, first impression is I like how it's uh, furnished with all this uh, wooden furniture and uh, the, it's got this like texture on the wallpaper and it's got this uh, wooden uh, vinyl flooring that's really interesting as opposed to the previous place that just seemed like a very bare minimalistic blank slate. So let's zoom up to the layout. So you've got uh, this uh, living room area to the left is your bedroom and bathroom and a large balcony. That's really nice. So let's uh, jump into the entrance. So, okay, to the left is um, an area for your fridge and some covers and to the right is also kitchen area with, uh, okay, I like this, uh, these wooden uh, cabinets. That's really nice, gives it a nice, pop in color okay got these fans here and then mm, okay not not that much room for dining just a little corner here but then uh you've got a decent living room space here okay i like this kind of somewhat leather uh couch and it comes with a nice tv and then okay this place is uh separated by a partition instead of being two separate rooms which i think is nice because um, when, when there's a translucent partition like this, a screen like this, it gives you this feeling of space where uh, if it's just a wall, then you, you feel a little bit more cramped. But then the trade-off of this is that your guests will see into your bedroom. So you're gonna learn to uh, make your bed each day so that um, your guests don't think you're a slob. <laughs> Okay, so um, let's step out to this large balcony overlooking this pool where, okay, you can actually jump in uh, this time. It's not that high. In fact, I encourage you to jump in because why not? You're this close. You may as well just wake up in the morning, uh, jump into your swim trunks, and then take a dip into this pool. That is part of the life in Hua Hin Beach Town. All right. Uh, does this balcony connect to the bedroom? No, it does not. So, okay, that would have been nice. Let's go into the bedroom, okay. Uh, a nice bed. Again, I like this wood finished furniture and um, I don't know, this texture on the wallpaper is, 
I guess. I mean, for me, it's a little bit too feminine, but if you like that, that's cool too. Okay, not as much uh, wardrobe space as the previous one. And then uh, the bathroom here. Okay, yeah, uh, bathroom with a shower, a regular shower head and a rain shower as well. Smaller mirror, smaller um, vanity countertop, but the overall, this place has this kind of cute beach bungalow vibe to it. That's really cool of it. And I really like the large balcony that you can just jump into the pool. I think that is very decadent. Hey, if you're gonna live in Hua Hin and have a holiday home, you uh, should be able to do that. All right, next we go to a one bedroom, one bathroom, 46.6 square meters in size, located on the fourth floor of the 88 condo Hua Hin, which was completed in May of 2016. This place is going for sale for 4.39 million baht, bringing the price per square meter to 94,000 baht per square meter. And uh, this place is actually for rent for 16,000 baht a month, which is, uh, yeah, a lot cheaper than its previous counterparts. And uh, it's actually because, as opposed to the first two places, this place is located uh, a bit inland. So you're not gonna be walking distance to the beach. It's a bit of a commute to the beach. So that's a trade-off you got there. But hey, if you're looking for uh, cheaper rent, then you may want to consider this place. That being said, this place has a pretty decent view from the balcony as well, as I will show you from a 3D walkthrough. Oh, and by the way, I'm breezing through these places very quickly in this video. If you wanna you know, have a look at the project itself and see the facilities, just click the link in the description of this video, because I've linked to all these places and you can check them out yourself. So, all right, let's uh, move on with uh, touring this place. So zooming up. Wow. Okay. So this is a corner room with a balcony wrapping around one side of the unit. That's really, really cool. And then, uh, yeah, you've got this, uh, oh, a corner pantry kitchen area in the bathroom there. Nice. So let's uh, jump in from the entrance. Okay. So to the left is uh, this uh, corner kitchen that a lot of people uh, long for. You've got nice, uh, decent uh, cabinetry overhead and below and then you've got this uh, <laughs> little bar area to, to dine for two and then you've got this uh, living room area here a little bit small but that's because um, they're giving you this large balcony so I'm gonna step out and show you the view that you got a really nice view wow okay let's let's um, stand at this corner here so to the left you've got some greenery some mountains and then uh, you've got uh, a view of the condominium itself. Do not jump into this. This is even more tempting than the first one, but I can tell you that this is not for diving from this high. Do not be tempted on a drunk Friday night. And then uh, overlooking beyond here, you've got some greenery and you see uh, some really nice mountains in the distance. Actually, uh, Hua Hin and Pertuop Kirikan province is uh, kind of hilly and mountain too. So apart from a view of the beach, you can also get gorgeous view of the mountains as well. That's really nice. Okay, they've got some s sitting uh, chairs and for you. And I like that they um, tucked in the air conditioner units in this corner here. A lot of places they just place it obnoxiously right over here and it's just going to interfere with your balcony experience. But this place did not do that. Um, let's step into the bathroom. Okay, yep. Nice, decent bathroom, uh, white, clean tiles, and uh, ooh, kind of like a little old school kind of shower head, but hey, uh, you can replace that very easily. And then uh, zooming into the bedroom, okay, a nice, decent uh, bedroom space, and you've got a view of that gorgeous mountain, and then you've got some space here to, you know, uh, put on some makeup if you're female or just get dressed and look at yourself, put your stuff here, nightstand. And then you've got, uh, ooh, a nice full, uh, full size mirror here and uh, sliding wardrobe. That's really nice. And oh, hello, tripod and camera that shot this place. Thank you for shooting this place, uh, team at Fazwaz. Okay, so zooming up at this place, this is 88 Condo Hua Hin, a bit more inland, but it gives you a gorgeous view of the mountains, large balcony and uh, this corner unit on a higher floor that I do not recommend jumping into the pool. 
Next, we move on to a two bedroom. So the size is increasing now. Two bedroom, two bathroom, 142 square meters in size on the ground floor uh, of the Malibu Khao Tao. And this place was completed in February of 2012. And uh, this place is located also very close to the beach as well, giving you that awesome Wahin beach town uh, lifestyle. And uh, this place is going for sale for 15 million bots, a bit of a jump, bringing the price per square meter to 105,000 baht per square meter, a more premium property here. And uh, you can rent it for 50,000 baht per month. So let's see what the fuss is all about for this place. And uh, okay, this is why uh, they're commanding a premium because at the ground floor, you can literally walk out and jump into the pool from your property. That is so cool. And then um, you can't see it from here, can you? Okay, and uh, if you swim all the way that way to this long, really long, cool pool, you get a view of the beach. That is fantastic. All right, um, so you, I can hang out here all day. Perfect, perfect for a holiday home, this place. You can buy it and you know it can serve as your own holiday home or you can rent it out yourself for the recommended price of 50K baht per month. Let's zoom up to the floor plan. Okay, so this is uh, has a longer layout. Now my first impression was, okay, these rooms here are gonna be really dark because they're not gonna be without any windows, but hey, there's actually a balcony here as well. So that's really cool. So let's jump into the uh, entrance. So you've got this uh, corridor here to put your stuff and you've got a nice mirror here. So a very uh, nice corridor to welcome your guests, give them a first impression. You can uh, put up some artwork here. And then uh, let's turn to the right first, okay? So it's, uh, okay, you've got some closet space here. So it's a sort of a walk-in closet. And then uh, you've got this uh, large bedroom here, nice. And then uh, it has a little balcony right here that you can step out and it's basically part of the project. So you've got some open air that can come in as well and uh, say hi to your neighbors. This place has a very resort feel to it. Uh, nice, uh, dark. I like this dark wood floor. It contrasts very well with the clean white walls. Yep, okay, and then let's step into the first uh, bathroom, yeah, a pretty standard bathroom with just a shower, okay? So let's step out to, okay, the dining area. So you've got, okay, a really decently sized uh, dining area here for your kitchen. You've got a washing machine and a dryer and plenty of uh, storage here for your laundry. And then you've got uh, lots of cabinetry here for your cooking ware and uh, ingredients. And uh, okay, a pretty uh, large dining area here on the left that's next to this wall like this, okay? And then there's a little nice cute partition like this um, to separate the uh, living room here that you can hang out, have a party, jump into the pool. If you live at a place like this, you're bound to always be in your swim trunks. Why not? That's why we're here. And then uh, the bedroom, the master bedroom comes with a large bed and then it, uh, you're able to wake up, uh, jump into your swim trunks and hop into this pool as well. How decadent is that? Speaking of decadent, we've got a walk-in closet and I like this dark wood finishing as well. That comes with a bathtub. Wow, okay, uh, my, my one critique about this bathtub is that, gosh, guys, you could have like put a window here so I can see into this pool to give me a view and then <laughs> the headrest is facing this way. So we're just facing the shower. No, turn it this way and then knock down uh, like a hole here, at least if you buy this place, put, a, put an opening here so you can see into the pool. Come on, guys. Then you've got, um, a double sink, a vanity counter for him and her with a uh, long uh, mirror here as well. That's very, very nice. So yeah, this place is great. Bit more pricey, but you know why. It gives you this ability to uh, jump right into the pool. 
Next, we move on to a four bedroom, three bathroom, 186 square meters in size, located on the third floor of Ban San Suk project, completed in December of 2010. This place is going for 36 million baht, bringing the price per square meter to ooh, pretty steep, 193,000 baht per square meter, and you can rent it for 120,000 baht per month. Yep, the largest in this video, but also the most expensive, both in terms of absolute pricing and in terms of price per square meter. So I'm gonna be very critical of this place because it better justify this price tag. So let's jump into a thread walkthrough of this place. So uh, going up, zooming up to the floor plan. So it's got multiple balconies. So that's gonna be the, uh, that better be the selling point of it. So I am going to start from the entrance. Okay, so you walk in here and then you've got a nice large kitchen area with uh, an uh, island table here. Um, yeah, okay, I like this um, very durable kitchen countertop here and with these tilings, that's very nice, okay. <laughs> Has an old school gas stove for uh, people who prefer that. And then uh, let's actually step into the living room area, okay. Very nice, spacious living room area. Lots of natural light spilling in. To the left here is, uh, okay, <laughs> microwave here. And you've got plenty of storage space and closet space here for, um, I don't know, your tea set and fine china or something like that, whatever you wanna put there. And uh, okay, uh, does it come furnished? It says it comes fully furnished, but I would make sure that I'm getting this sound system as well, because that's gonna really add to this living room area. Okay, let's step out to the balcony and uh, see what they're trying to sell us. So, gives you a gorgeous view of the pool area and of the, of the property. Okay, very nice, luxurious property. I love this grass, lawn, and trees. Very well kept, very well maintained. Feels like a luxury resort. And uh, the beach is right there, ladies and gentlemen. You have a view of Huahin Beach and uh, uh, Huan Hin faces east, uh, looks eastwards into the Gulf of Thailand. So what you're gonna see here is a sunrise view as opposed to a sunset view from Pattaya. So now you can see why this place commands such a high premium. Okay, so let's see uh, the rest of this property. So from the living room, I'm gonna step into the master bedroom. Okay, very nice, large master bedroom. Uh, lots of natural light spilling in. And um, okay, before we get to that, we're gonna go into the master bathroom, which uh, gives you a mastery experience because it comes with a uh, gorgeous bathtub. And then you've got a shower separately. And uh, yeah, very nice. And then you can uh, see that sunrise view as well from uh, your bathtub. That's really nice, nice vanity countertop, very gorgeous mirror. I like this clean, minimalistic finishing to it. And then uh, stepping to, into the master bedroom, okay? This bed uh, faces the balcony and then you can see that sunrise from the beach there when you wake up. That's Wow, that's a really nice experience there. And then, uh, okay, let's step into the second bedroom, okay? Second bedroom, you don't, you don't get that view of the beach. Uh, you get a view of uh, yeah, your neighbors there. Um, and then, yeah, just another room. You can maybe turn this into an office. Uh, what else, what else? Third bedroom that comes with a balcony, okay, a smaller room. And then you have a balcony, okay? Yep, facing uh, this other side of the property. So uh, these seem like very um, minimally constructed homes. So there is the risk of um, this land plot being bought, bought up and then these houses being teared down and then it built into another property in the future. But that has nothing to do, it won't interrupt your um, experience from this side of the balcony. Uh, so these these rooms, you can turn it into a guest bedroom or turn it into an office as well. Another bedroom, okay, four bedrooms, right? Okay, yeah, uh, seems like this, play, this person just turned it into 
uh, storage and then yep oh okay it comes with a dedicated laundry room okay nice uh, separate from the rest of the unit so you can put all your uh, cleaning supplies there and here's a little uh, uh, bathroom here as well uh, that can, so this area can be your maids quarters as well your maid can stay here as well yep and then uh, what else we got okay so here's another bathroom here that comes with a yeah just a standard shower I like this uh, clean finishing very minimal I like it nice so this is Ban San Sook a large four bedroom with a gorgeous view it comes with a premium though but this really gives you a gorgeous romantic kind of Hua Hin beach sunrise lifestyle that a lot of people are craving like I said, see the links in the description of this video for how to start your property search. You can either browse listings yourself on the FazWise website on stuff that I've uh, preloaded for you, or if you prefer to just have a real estate agent do all the work for you uh, because they know the market and then you can just sit back and, and receive recommendations, you can do that as well by filling out the form in the description of this video. Thank you so much for watching. See the videos that just popped up to continue uh, watching uh, reviews of properties just like this one. And uh, I'll uh, see you in the next video.